Hello Gemini and welcome to your weekly Moonstone and Gemstone reading for the week ahead of September 12th. Um, as I always say, the energies can start anytime now and go into the week. Um, I did post my tarot card readings yesterday, so if you didn't get a chance to see those, go check those out. And let's get on with your reading. Where the stones won't fall for you guys. All right. Okay, guys. Mm, interesting. Interesting. Um, there's a lot going on in the home. Also, career, work. Very much so in focus here. And also some, you know, some confusion or some missing information, um, inspiration. Okay, so I'm going to start with the runes as I always do. And this rune here is intuition, knowledge, and inspiration. And I'm seeing um, this here too because you are pretty much socializing. It could be with um, people that are very close to you or people that you call your home. So it's like you're forming some ideas. Um, there are new people coming in, and this stone is up really high. So it's just saying that um, um, it, it probably associated to people that you do know or um, that are your home or work or very like-minded people. And um, they're, they're good people here, and this one's standing up. So this one person can have a very good an idea of something that can actually prove very inspiring. Um, added knowledge and also there's a sense here because we have this stone here that there is some maybe missing information and um, you know you need to get your facts straight in some in something that is not very clear and something that may be blocking you and it could be some something that you're trying to move forward in and this could be home related this could be work because it is coming under from the home and tangible goods and career here too and also, these are things that you're trying to implement. What I'm seeing here also is money coming into the future. It's not quite there yet, but there is some money coming in. And this could be from an outside source. And this could be from, you know, an inspiration you had. That is a possible way. This also could be money not connected to the way you usually make money, which is very interesting. Um, you. I don't know if it's gambling or it's just kind of um, a weird way of receiving money, meaning um, not a source that you're expecting from. That is for some of you. And it's, you know, coming in here. Um, also, and it's just a little bit um, strange. It's a little strange here. Also, when I come around here, we're looking at these are money stones, too. And these are probably some projects or things that um, you've been trying to do. This could also mean that a lot of you are thinking of moving, have been thinking of moving, possibly um, also job. There are some of you are changing your status um, or just the way things have been in the home are changing. And it's focusing more than on some kind of projects or ideas or things. There's added knowledge coming in, which is very, very interesting. Also, some help here. It could watch, watch your health a little bit. Um, and then children are coming into focus here, too. I don't know if you have children or not, but there's some kind of very um, child-type energy. Maybe some of you will be working with children, studying about children. It could work out so many ways here. This is a very general reading. And... Um, then your focus is going to be shifting like more into um, friendships. There are new people coming in. Some of these people are bringing you some good ideas. Some of these um, have money. These could be opportunities coming in too. And um, 
and some wishes and dreams that you could actually bring into some kind of fruition here. And this is coming in later too. This is maybe even a family member. So this is really interesting. I'm going to pull a um, gemstone card for the week for you guys. Give it a quick shuffle. What you get. I love gemstones. Oh, you got Aura Light. Aura Light 23. Aura Light is a beautiful stone. Um, this is also saying there's a concentration on uh, partnerships, stability, and also um, compromise and balance. Um, this stone is, uh, usually we call it the um, soul connector. It is an exceptionally high frequency stone. And it's the best timing is in Aquarius, when the sun is in Aquarius, or Aquarius some aspects around, but of course it's high frequency, it's constantly being able to manifest. Um, this is really telling you that your soul path here is really to um, recognition of your ego, um, the soul, and your higher, higher consciousness. Um, this is telling me that there is multi layers in your soul, and it's accelerated and peeled off with spiritual growth. And you are basically what they're saying is you're basically in on this earth to share your knowledge. You have this ability to move between different dimensions um, and your your vibrations on Earth. Um, uh, what else can I say about this? It's it does raise your consciousness, and and others do usually follow you. Um, it's telling you this um, card is specifically telling you to recognize that you are um, a part of humanity, but you're there to peel off some layers, um, send yourself in an in inner peace and connect to your like higher mind before making any um, rash decisions. It's very beneficial for contacts that come through friends and family. I'm seeing this even in your reading, which is really interesting that you got this card. Um, and uh, I think that's about it that I could say about this card, but also. Um, what I would do is basically, it's a, to me, it's an as above, so below, or as without, so within, um, you know, as without, so within, it leads to like a sense of, um, rightness and immense well-being. So this is the card you got. I really do love this card. Um, I love that stone. And let's pull a a spiritual angel tarot card. Everybody seems to like this. They're huge. All right. And let's see what you get. You got the lovers. Intimate relationships. Carefully weigh your decisions and good health. So, and that's a major like arcana card in the tarot. So this is focusing on on things that are like a marriage to you, um, making choices, making some decisions. Love can be in question here. I didn't really see many love stones here. I just saw more things that are very important to you and trying to put together family, possibly friends. That's all love, whatever it is to you, but um, also good health, you know, you got health here. Um, so that's what came up for you this week. Anyway, Gemini, that is your reading for the week of September 12th. Please like, share, and subscribe. And see you tomorrow for my usual coffee cup readings. Bye, guys.